Value Line is a popular investment resource that is designed to help investors make informed investment decisions that fit their individual goals and their level of risk. The library currently subscribes to Value Line in print and as an online database. This brief tutorial will show you how to quickly look up a stock report in the Value Line database. First, go to the library's research page by typing the library.org slash research into your web browser's address bar. Next, select Browse All Databases by Title to view a complete list of library databases. These databases are arranged alphabetically. Scroll to the bottom to find the link for ValueLine. A valid library card is required to access ValueLine from outside the library. To quickly get a current stock report, enter the company's ticker symbol into the search box at the top of the page. Let's search for the locally owned O'Reilly's Auto Parts. Their ticker symbol is O-R-L-Y. Once you've entered the ticker symbol, select the correct company name from the list to continue your search. We're then able to immediately view the digital report, or we can choose to view the print version of the report. To view the print report, select the PDF Reports link to the right of the page. This will allow you to choose which report you wish to view, and then open a PDF version of that report in your browser. There is a lot of information packed into each stock report. Let's briefly go over a few of the commonly used features. First, we find the timeliness, safety, and technical ranks in the upper left-hand corner. These ranks allow stock researchers to quickly gauge a stock's expected price performance and level of risk. Next, you can find a recent price for the stock at the top of each report. ValueLine also provides historical data and projections for each stock. And lastly, notice the analyst commentary in the bottom half of the report. In this section, an analyst shares their expectations for the future of the stock. If you wish to print the report, you can do so using your browser's printer functions.